In this video we're going to be working some footwork for weight shifting. Playing on where the center of mass is. Let's go through it there. Okay, so in these positions, so you can play with shifting your weight for various reasons. See there's a weight transfer in the back, the front, back, the front, back, the front, back, to the front, with an element of rotation. How much rotation depends now, on your foot position and the range you want to get. Okay, it's not so much rotation. I still don't need much rotation. But if you're going over along the range, shifting your weight forward, you can rotate longer through the body. Instead of falling or stepping, utilizing gravity. So you can step. Okay, drop step. <clears throat> oh, you're gonna put weight on something. Push it down. No, obviously you're getting up. Holding it down. You're leaning the weight there. Balance. Placing the weight. Place your weight on the drop. The speed. It starts becoming a heavy punch. <clears throat> Element of rotation to a heel toe twist. You can use this is a nice tool for running. So you make it more subtle at first. You can see from rolling through from the heel to that foot, shifting the weight this up, dropping that one, shifting back again. You can see this creates a lateral shift in my vertical center and my center of mass. This is a shift of weight which creates quite a lot of energy. You can play with adding in a bit of a hip thrust and a bit of rotation on the swing, and then adding a shoulder wide neck wave and extending out into the arms. And there you're starting to get the beginnings of shifting your weight and extending it through your hands. There's various ways of doing this. You can use more gravity, more rotation, getting it. So you can emphasize rotational aspects. See my heel, hip, heel, hip, heel, hip, shoulder. Well, when you come out, almost on a 180. One, 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 one. This is larger rotation, good for longer range. You can use more forward tilt and gravity acceleration pulling you off your over your foundation because yeah a lot of the time you want to have your center of gravity your center of mass kind of um, safely tucked away between your legs and now and then you can do a guess there's a back so this isn't even switching I'm just quickly shifting my center of mass one Wow. Controlling your center of mass gives you much better balance. It also gives you the option to use okay. your mass Close as here. kinetic energy when moving. You can add shoulder rolls and head movement on those steps. So it's hand positioning. So you've got weight shifting between the base, head movement, and varying degrees of direct position. So back. Very forward, more upright. Generally, upright is a better option, but there are times when you know you you need to access the other ones for function. Other more extreme positions of rotation, rotation and hip thrust. Yeah, so you can play with weight shifting, shifting your weight to strikes, 
strikes, kicks. You can see there's a large movement on my center of mass. I'm kicking all the way through. I'm not just stopping here or there, there. I'm kicking through. This is Sparta! Push! 